This is a warning. Peggy 18. I found some shocking information from the Sunni fiqh books which I want to share with you. And I'm going to mention two topics in this video. This is my gift for all Muslims during the month of Ramadan. The following information is according to the Hanbali Madhab. In the famous book called Al-Mughni, volume 10 by Ibn Qudama on page 152, we can find Al-Qadi said, there is no punishment for a man who has sexual intercourse with a little girl who did not reach the age of puberty yet. This is of course in complete agreement with chapter 65, ayah 4 of the Quran, where Allah allows any Muslim man to sleep with little girls who did not reach the age of puberty yet. And if we continue reading on the same page, it says, there is no punishment for the man if he forced his finger in the vagina of the little baby girl. And it also says, and if a woman puts the penis of a young boy in her vagina, a boy who did not reach the age of 10 years, then there is no punishment for that woman. Wait, what? Yes, you heard that correctly. Both men and women can be pedophiles in Islam. There is no punishment at all for both of them. Muslims have a free pass for pedophilia. In Majma Zawaid wa Manba al Fawaid, Volume 1 by Al Haythami, on page 334, hadith number 1248, we can read Rasulullah said to his companions, If Satan approaches one of you while you're praying and Satan opened up your butthole, Wait, 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 wait. Satan can play with the anus of Muslims while they are praying. So, ya Muslimun, Satan has full control over your anus. Satan has the power and can control your anus while you are praying. Oh man, I'm so happy that I'm not a Muslim right now. Phew! Thanks for watching. Please share our videos on social media and stay away from Islam. <laughs>